Hello and welcome. Thanks for joining us. We've got open air baseball for you on the show. It's the Seattle Mariners taking on the New York Yankees. And we'll be back with the first pitch. Right, Just about ready to go. Towing the slab in today's game. Jamison Tyon. Very solid starters, able to repeat his mechanics on a consistent basis, which allows him to move through a lineup and get deep into a ball game. Got him. And one gone. Well, he didn't get the call on the mound the pitch before. Felt like he should have had him looking, I think. But, you know, that's good composure right there. He found a way to come back with another good pitch to get him to swing and miss. Next offering is down low. No score just getting started. Top of the first. That one in for a strike, two and two. Fouled off left side. One down, base is empty. And a foul ball, he stays alive. And he hits a ground ball right side. That's a hit. So a man aboard now with one away. Gotta love the resiliency he showed in that at bat, battling with two strikes. Not much to this one other than just a willingness to go the other way and put the ball in play. That's a team at bat right there. Nice job of staying back and letting the ball get deep. Donaldson puts the squeeze on that one. Two down. Man at first. Now batting Mitch Hanniger. This one popped up. Connor Falefa under it. And makes the play, and that's out number three. Bottom of the first, and here is Anthony Rizzo. Here comes a pitch. Out towards right center. That's well struck. On its way. Turning, looking, and that one is gone. Anthony Rizzo circles the bases and they jump out front. It's one nothing. The pitcher knew as soon as that ball left his fingertips, it was trouble. Right on a platter, right down the heart of the plate. I'm sorry, but big league hitters don't miss that pitch. Here is Aaron Judge. Two and one on Judge. Oh, and now this one's crushed. This one's on its way. And gone. Aaron Judge leads the yard. And they boost their lead. It's 2-0. That was quite the home run, Siggy, as we take it in again with StatCast. 114 miles an hour off the bat. Yeah, and plenty of distance, too. I mean, with that kind of exit velo, if you can get it up in the air with good backspin... It's going to be a tape measure shot. Here's Joey Gallo. And a pitch. Stays alive. 2013 in the playoffs. You caught one as the Red Sox played the Rays in the division series. I sacrificed a bracelet. It was my wrist and my hand. Could be extra bases. Around first, digging for two. Round second, digging for third. And he's got himself a triple. John Carlos Stanton to the plate now. And that one is lifted in the air. Hanniger makes his way towards it. Great effort as he's able to haul it in. And that should get the job done as he tags from third. He scores on the sack fly, and they're up by three. Every day during batting practice, these outfielders get about 10 minutes of balls in the gaps. They practice this, and when the game comes, they make the play perfectly. Can't get there, and now maybe extra bases. He's in with a double, and that's his second double of the night. 
We all saw it was hit hard, but how hard was it, Singy? StatCast is here with the answer. Yeah, Boog, it says the exit velo was 113 miles per hour, and it looked every bit of it, didn't it? I mean, just an impressive swing of the bat, and clearly he saw it out of the pitcher's hand, no problem. Makes the grab, two down. And up next for New York, Aaron Hicks. The switch hitter batting right. That one is absolutely belted. That's back. And that one is off the wall. The run comes in from second, and it's 4-0. Well done, drives in the run. Absolutely blasted that one into the gap, but just didn't have quite enough to clear the wall out there. Maybe a little more elevation under it, and it carries over, but that's a swing you'll be happy with every time. Rodriguez trots over to his left. He's got it, and the inning is over. But the long ball was working. Back here at the ballpark, top of the second, Eugenio Suarez up to the plate now. Next offering is in for a strike. He's already pitching with a 4 nothing lead, so we should see him be aggressive. Fill up the strike zone. Don't issue free passes. Late swing. Fouled off. The wind of the pitch. Gallo ranging back. Racing. Makes the catch. And there's one down. Next to hit, J.P. Crawford. J.P. Crawford. Bounce to the right. Torres over to first. Two up, two down. Two outs, base is empty. And now the center fielder, Julio Rodriguez. Swings and misses. And good work there as he gets a one, two, three. Bottom half of inning number two. And stepping in for the Yankees, Kyle Higashioka. This one lifted in the air, left field. Kelman settles under this one. Puts it away for the out. Here's the Yankees leadoff hitter, Anthony Rizzo. One for one so far today with a solo homer in his first at bat. That's out to center field. Rodriguez drifts towards it. And there's two down. And now big number 99, Aaron Judge. The 1-1. Judge rips that one. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And that'll do it. Down in order, go to Yankees. They lead 4-0. And welcome back. Now the left fielder, Jared Kellner. Next offering is in for a strike. Is there a little wrinkle to that? I think there was. Yeah. A little slider action. Next pitch has popped up. Donaldson on the move. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And a quick out number one. That was a good pitch to hit right down the heart of the plate. Had pretty good timing on it. Just got underneath it a little bit and popped it up. Now it's Tom Murphy. Bounce to the right side. Steps on first for the out. Back to the top of the lineup. Here's Adam Frazier. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And that's the third out. Mariners go down. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And now it's Joey Gallo. 3-2 now. Swung on. Belted. That one's got a chance. And it's gone! Joey Gallo blasts one out, and they add to the lead. It's 5 zip. Knew what pitch he wanted to hit, spent on some other pitches in this at bat, was very patient, and it paid off. Giancarlo Stanton at the plate. Hanniger drops steps, heads back on it. 
The pitch. Oh, this ball is crushed into left field. It's on its way and gone. John Carlos Stanton goes deep, and they add to their lead. It's six nothing. That's their fourth home run of the game. They can't stop, and they won't stop hitting home runs in this one, Boog. They're clearly feeding off of each other at the dip. Here comes the manager out of the dugout, and he'll make a move for the bullpen. That'll do it for Robbie Ray. And as he heads off, he'll step aside for a minute. Back with the new pitcher after this break. New pitcher for the Mariners, Justice Sheffield. He's being eased into the game here with the bases empty. Rodriguez gliding as he moves to his left. And it's caught for the out. Now back. The Here is the young phenom labor. Torres, oh, oh for one with a flyout. Swing and a miss, three and two now. Torres, a guy the Yankees acquired for Heraldus Chapman back in 2016. He is fearless. You can't tell if he's been in this league for eight years or two years. Aaron Hicks at the plate. So now one and two. Good late sink on that fastball. Out of the hand looks so good. And then by the time he gets in the hitting zone, hard to get the barrel to it. Next pitch misses. Two balls, two strikes. And now it's filled up. And a pitch. The other way. And there's a hit. And that keeps the inning alive. Wasting no time. He's two for two now on the night. And just a triple and home run away from the cycle. Seriously, we're starting with this already. Isaiah Kiner Falefa up to the plate. On the ground, right side, in plenty of time to first. Third out, and that ends the frame. But the long ball was. Welcome back. Start of the fourth. And now for Seattle, Ty France. The 1 1. In the air, right field. Judge cutting across. Makes a nice grab at a full sprint. And there's one away. Here's Jesse Winker. Jesse Winker. Up the middle, and that one finds its way through. So they get a man aboard with a one out single. One gone runner at first. And now it's the cleanup hitter for the Mariners. Mitch Hanniger. Flied out his first time. One ball, two strikes. The one, two. Foul ball. Righty to the plate. And a swing and a miss. That's out number two. Toughest pitch to hit. Fastball on the outer black. Man, sometimes you just got to tip your cap. And Eugenio Suarez up to hit now. Swings and misses. That is strike two. The pitch. Swing and a tapper that rolls foul. The one two. And there's a ball. And the right hander deals. Out there to center. Hicks is there for it. Puts the squeeze on it. And that's the inning. Mariners lead one. Back here at the ballpark, John Chabi and Chris Singleton with you. And leading off the bottom of the fourth, Kyle Higashioka. On the ground, right side. And it's through for a hit. So now back to the top of the order. Just a simple ground ball the other way. They had eyes on it, man. Sometimes that's all you need to do. Just let the ball travel, put the ball in play, and just hope it finds a hole. 
Swing and a miss. Going to count one and two. This guy's sink has so much drop in it, it's almost like a split finger fastball. Instead of just weak contact and balls on the ground, he gets swings and misses. And a ball and two strikes. Grounder might be two. Off balance feed, there's one. On the first double play. Two outs, bases empty. And next for New York, Aaron Judge. Fouled off again, and it remains three and two. Payoff pitch. In the air, pretty deep out to center field. Rodriguez, reaching back towards the wall. Brings it in with a nice run and grab. All set for the start of the inning. And stepping in for the Mariners, J.P. Crawford. High fly ball, right field. Reaching for it, makes the catch. Stepping in, Julio Rodriguez. Fouled off down the right side. Well, on the mound, very efficient. Able to produce an outcome, it seems like, within the third or fourth pitch of just about every at bat. Swing and a miss, struck him out. And he's down on strikes for the second time today. Two outs, base is empty. And up next for Seattle, Jared Kellner. He's 0 for 1. Bounced up the middle. Base hit. Joey gets on base and keeps it going. Just kept it simple. Played Pepper with the middle of the infield and took it back where it came from. And there's just no one there to knock it down. So here's Murphy now. Base hit. So that's two straight, two out hits. And now they'll have runners on the corners with two away. Well, they call that an advantage count for a reason. You're so much more likely to get something you can handle. Off the bat, that one registered at 105 miles per hour, man. That is smoking, and these days you hear it all the time. Well, we'll hold that thought as that's the third out, and we'll end the... Mariners leave a couple, still up against a 6 nothing deficit. We head to the bottom of the fifth. Joey Gallo steps to the plate. Now fly ball to right center. Rodriguez brings it in, and there's one down. And here is Giancarlo Stanton. He's already homered in this game. In the air, out towards left center. Rodriguez right there to make the grab, and there's two down. Here's Josh Donaldson. Two balls, two strikes to count with two outs. For this guy, it's truly a battle when he steps into the box. Only one thing on his mind, seeing that pitch out of the hand and hit it hard somewhere. And now the lefty. And there's ball four. Boom, do you think you could draw a walk in the bigs if we gave you enough at bats? Oh, that's a good question. Um, I think that if they gave the pitcher a full scouting report on me, yes, I think I could draw a walk. Fall off foul. Great RBI spot here. Just got to stay focused on the pitch. The runner will be in motion, so something in the gap should definitely score it. And a foul ball, he stays alive. Donaldson off the of first with two away. That's a bullet, but it goes foul. And a 3-2. And ball four to a board. Well, interesting, he went with the off speed and walked the hitter. Man, you got to challenge the guy with the fastball. So up next, Aaron Hicks. Really good piece of hitting last time going to the opposite field. And a 2-1 hammered, but foul. Swing and a pop-up. Foul territory for the catcher. 
Murphy makes the catch, and that'll do it. And welcome back. And now, Ty France. He swings and fouls one off. The wind and the pitch. Lifted in the air, right center field. Judge is under it and puts the squeeze on that. One away. Up next for Seattle. Jesse Winker now at the plate. Jesse. And that's a base hit. So a man aboard now with one away. Seems like he got exactly what he was looking for right there. That's a good sound coming off the bat, man. And as he connected out front and ripped it into the outfield, that's one of those swing. Over to Torres. And it's a double play to end the inning. 8-9-1 scheduled. Welcome back. Bottom of the six. And stepping in for the Yankees, Isaiah Kiner-Falefa. Now a screamer into the outfield. Drops in for a hit. Couldn't run it down. Safe at second with a leadoff double. Nice double right there. Loud contact coming off the bat. Didn't get enough air under to drive it out of here, but you'll take that swing and that result every time. Now, Kyle Higashioka. Line drive. That's a base hit. Connor Falefa around third. Play it home. He's safe. And they're pulling away up by seven now. Two consecutive base hits for these guys here. Anytime you rip a line drive the other way, you feel really good about what you did at the plate. You trusted your hands, you let the ball travel, and you took the barrel straight to it. That's great work right there. He can't get there. That should be extra bases. And it bangs up against the wall. Higashioka coming home. He scores. It's 8-0. A little more backspin on that instead of the top spin. And he's jogging around the bases rather than pulling up at second. So, man aboard. Now it's Aaron Judge up to the plate. One for three. That one blasted deep to right. Way back there. Hits the fence. Run comes in from second, and they now lead by nine. Pulls into second. That's an RBI double. Eric Swanson on the pitch out of the pen here. And we'll see how he performs in this situation with his team down big. Well, at this point of the ball game, we're talking about middle innings, and you need a little length out of this arm coming out of the bullpen. We'll see just how many outs he's able to give his skipper. 3-2. Stays alive. He's got one already tonight. I wouldn't be surprised if he pops another one here. Next offering is fouled back. Judge leads off second with nobody out. And it's fouled away. At the belt and fires. Fouled off again. And it remains three and two. And out number one on the grab. Here's Stanton now. Still only one out here in the inning. And a pop-up right side foul territory. France makes the grab. And there's two away. Now it's Josh Donaldson's turn to hit. Swings and misses. And that is strike two. Some activity in the Mariners' bullpen. Anthony Misevich getting ready to go. And here it comes. That one hammered center field. That ball's carrying. Pulls it in on the warning track. Six full. The Yankees nine and the Mariners nothing. 
back here at the ballpark. New inning getting started. Now the third baseman, Eugenio Suarez. And he deals. Swing and a foul back. That's out of play. On the ground. Lays out, but he can't squeeze it. And he beats it. He's safe. Man at first, J.P. Crawford up next for the Mariners. Swing and a miss. It's a ball and two strikes. And a pitch. Swings and pulls it foul to the right side. And a pitch. The punch out there. So he's gotten deep into this game. And at least so far, not showing a ton of signs of fatigue. Here's the center fielder, Julio Rodriguez, who's 0 for 2 with a pair of strikeouts. To second, that's one. What a double play that was. Inning over. This one pretty. Set for the last half of the seventh, here is Glaber Torres. The wind of the pitch. Ground ball up the middle. Crawford throws to first in time. And the leadoff hitter set down to open the seventh. Taron Hicks now. The pitch. And a foul ball. He stays alive. Kicks and deals. Stays alive. The pitch. And now the count filled up three and two. Good plate appearance there. Able to take the walk. Well, a breaking ball in that 3-2 count kind of tells you that that's the pitch he has the most confidence in right now. Just couldn't find the strike zone. Next offering is foul back. Right-handed reliever. Swings through that one. It's a strikeout. And there are two down. Boog, if you can set up a good two-strike splitter with a fastball on the previous pitch, it's going to be so tough to recognize and adjust your swing to get a piece of it. Clearly had him reaching for it right there. The next offering misses. Three and one now. Next offering is foul back. Fouled off again, and it remains three and two. And a payoff pitch. So now two on and two outs. Very close off the outside corner. Could have easily been called a strike in that location. So the lineup flips over. Anthony Rizzo steps to the plate. He's already homered here in this one. Next offering is foul back. And now two and two. Two walks in the inning already, and he just doesn't seem comfortable out there. Like he can find the right mechanics and then repeat them. Hicks, the lead runner out at second. Higashioka on at first with two down. Comes up empty as he chases that one in the dirt. Murphy on to first. Out with room to spare, and that's the inning. Yanks strand a pair, but they're still in command. 9 nothing.
And here comes the Yankees manager to the mound. Pitching change coming. New pitcher coming on, the veteran, Lucas Lipke. And he'll try to keep this big lead right where it is. And that one is lifted in the air. Judge cutting across. Can't get there. And now maybe extra bases. And he makes it into third with a leadoff triple. Good job of just putting the ball in play with two strikes. Just a beautiful triple from start to finish. Got a pitch he could drive, turned on it, and hammered it out front into the gap. Right out of the box. I love how he was hustling. And I think he knew he was going for three as soon as it touched down. Cut on and miss. Struck him out. One gone here. You know, the danger with the slider is leaving it out over the heart of the plate and getting contact on it. If you're going to miss, you want to miss towards the corners, not in the middle. Right there, he does a great job with hard break at the end. He ran it inside. Very difficult to do anything when you're tied up like that as a hitter. Over to first. Frazier retired. Now the number two hitter, Ty France. Ground ball right side and foul ball. Next pitch has popped up. Makes the catch inning over. Sergio Romo will take over here. He comes in with his team trailing by a bunch, so he'll try to keep it where it is. It's Aaron Judge now. Right-hander kicks, deals. Up the middle, Frazier handles the chance. To first, Judge out of the play. And up next for New York, Joey Gallo. Left-hand batter waits. And that's in for a strike. Action in the bullpen for Seattle. Anthony Misevich, the lefty, looks to be getting himself ready. And that one fouled off. Kicks and fires. And a foul ball, he stays alive. Swing and a miss. And he's down on strikes. Two gone now. Well, I'm not sure what he was waiting on right there. He got the change up and still laid on it. You rarely see that. It almost makes you think that he was trying to set the pitcher up. I mean, if you can't catch up to the off-speed stuff, there's no way you're going to touch a fastball. He can't get there. It's a base hit. Now he'll turn for second. In safely. It's a double and his second hit. Drove that ball nicely, put a great swing on it, and it jumped off his bat. Kind of put it all together there, and he's rewarded with the double. Man on second, two down. Strike two. Now there's a certain point where you have to commit to what you think you see, and he guessed wrong right there. Nasty slider with just terrific bite at the end. Two outs and one in scoring position. And a swing and a miss. And that's that. One left for the Yankees, but they still hold a 9-0 lead. And welcome back. We go to the ninth, and now the DH, Jesse Winker. Swing and a tapper. Throw on to Rizzo. Now one gone in the ninth. Now batting. And now it's going to be Mitch Hanniger, the pitch. Good eye right there. Rip towards third. And they take care of Hanniger for the out. Eugenio Suarez getting ready to hit. Two down. Up the middle. Collected by Torres. 
Throw to first. Ball game. And the Yankees take this one in a blowout. Well, when you win by nine runs, you have plenty of insurance runs. It's a huge confidence boost when you can just put that many runs up on the board. And I'll tell you what, the next game starter is saying, hey, I hope you guys save